Hello everyone, this is Mimi's Crafty Shop and I have just finished with my two Halloween journals. So I wanted to show them and let y'all take a little look at them. They were so much fun making them, I had a great time. Um, this, both of them I made them with the uh, manila folders and they're nine by six, both of them have two signatures. This one is made with Tsunami Rose um, and this one is made with TLC Creates and they are just yummy and full of stuff. This one here, I'm calling it Badalicious because it's got the bat on there, and it says Happy Halloween on the front, and the card that I put on the front has bats. This is a cute little uh, removable flower that I found. I thought it was so cute. And this one here has got the witch on the front with the cat, and this pretty rosette thing that I um, ordered from um, Etsy, and it was kind of a Halloween look. Paper doily there, uh, it says ghosts and goblins and Halloween. And I made this little uh, clip here, it's a little um, spider, and he's removable, so you could put him on something else. And this one, uh, they both on the back have um, little cards I put on there, and they are pockets, so I thought they I made little pockets out of them. I absolutely love this one here. And I put this in there. This is October 31st. All right, well, let me get started on this one first. Um, like I said, they have two signatures in them. They're pretty much the same, um, except the uh, different digitals in them. Um, this right here on the front, I made this. This is one of those um, bags that you get to put candy in. And I used it in here and just made a pocket out of it. And I made this little um, notebook here and did the, you know, hand sewing on there with just, turned out really cute. And yes, Miss uh, Sue, if you're watching this, I have paper in here that um, I bought from you last year. So I really love it, it's so cute. See the little cat on the front. front. And this is, uh, I sew black lace on this and it's got a lot of pockets, a lot of ephemera in it, embellishments, and that cute, that little tag I made up, that little girl, love it. This right here is a, um, from Michaels that I got. This paper is just really pretty. It's very vintage. Um, if you like the vintage look, it's very vintage. And here's two little cards, and I made up a lot of little pockets. There's plenty of place for writing and, um, you know, or putting your little Halloween pictures in. Some people like to have Halloween parties. My daughter has one, uh, goes to one every year and loves dressing up. They're gonna be the Hocus Pocus, which is her and her other two friends. This is, um, I love the Tsunami Rose. This is so cute. I love the butterflies. And there's that rose again. And this is just so vintage looking. There's Mr. Frankenstein. A witch and she's taking a bubble bath in the black pot. But I had a really great time making these. Um, these will be for sale in my Etsy store, so if anybody's interested in them, purchasing them. I love this card right here. This is some stuff I ordered from scrapbook.com. Cute. I thought that was turned out really pretty. I love that. Uh, it's got back background. It's kind of a glossy um, gold look. And um, the papers are tea dyed and they've got a really nice feel to them. So cute, I love the spider look. Another pocket, sew that on. Y'all can see it okay. I like this little right here. It says an owl set watching in a tree just as wise as he could be, watching tricksters from door to door run, trick or treating and having fun. After watching the entire scene, he said, hoo hoo, it's Halloween. I love the owls. In fact, I have a shirt that I wear that um, is owl, got an owl on it. That's Halloween. Double, tr double, double toll and trouble, fire burn and cauldron bubbles, William Shakespeare.
did a lot of um, embellishments on here. I love these, I had these from last year. Put some ribbon on the side. Some more beautiful black lace. This is kind of a little collage I did up. I thought it turned out cute. I absolutely love this. I nearly put this on the front because I just love the way she did this up. Um, it's, 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 you know, it, it could be used for something else, I think. You probably could use it in a regular vintage journal. But I just loved it. There's a little card that says Happy Halloween. A little tag made up. And this right here is so cute. The pumpkin, I cut him out. And the little cat on the top. Oh, he's so cute. And I put some sparkly glue on him. You, know, you probably can't tell. And these are some Tim Holt stamps that I had. They're the kind of spongy ones. Little ghost. Another pocket. And this right here actually came from um, Calico Collage. I did a, a Halloween journal that I had for sale in my Etsy store, and I loved it. It was really cute. She did a, her collages were really pretty. This pumpkin with the I had the little hat on there. A little witchy, vintage witch. I thought that turned out cute. I like the butterflies on there. It's a spooky good time. And up another collage. It's a sticker I had. Eat, drink, and be scary. And these right here, um, I meant to show these. Uh, these are some buttons that I put on my signatures. They're halloween -y. And uh, spider, it says boo. There's a skeleton. And then this one's a bat. If you can see it or not, the bat. See the bat? Those are so cute. I got those last year at the end of the season. So I knew I was gonna use them. And this is just a little, Love this paper right here, isn't that pretty? It's just so pretty. This is some, um, uh, this actually would come from a table runner and I cut it up and used it in my books. I thought it was really pretty and cute. I think I got that at, I don't know, um, might've been at Walmart last year. Eat, drink, and be scary. Little tag I made up. This is one of my favorite little cards. A little postcard. It says S is for spooky. Another little writing place. Interested, do y'all dress up for Halloween or go to Halloween parties? Um, we dressed up a couple of years ago. A friend of ours turned 50 and she had us to dress up. And my husband and I dressed up in this 80s theme, um, 70s, 80s uh, disco, because both of us were born in the early 60s. Uh, we, we did it, and oh my gosh, I loved it. I ordered my costume from Amazon. It was so cute. Even my daughter wore it that next year. I'll see if I can find a picture of it and I'll, I'll, I'll put it on with this. It is so cute. A little witch there on the front. Some more of your paper, Sue. This is a beautiful orange um, lace that I put on there and sewed it on. Sewed a lot of pockets in here. Love that card right there. I got that the other day. It came in a little kit I bought. This is so cute. The tags are so much fun to make to me. And this is Sami Rose. It's so pretty. Um, that's part of the tea, um, Calico Collage. I, Actually, that was a um, travel notebook kit, and I just took and making some small ones out of it. This is kind of a little collage I made up, and I took those paper doilies, and I used that Lindsay um, spray and that, oh, tattered, some tattered spray that I used, and then just put these stickers on there. I thought it was cute. These little buttons, again. 
These have button, the same thing, the little buttons on there. And I put them down so they could hang out. I thought that, I think that's cute. I love this little, did some stamping on there. Isn't that cute? Got me some new stamps. I'm so excited. I also bought the Tim Holtz stamper deal. Um, I tried it a little bit the other day. I'm, I'm gonna watch some videos on it and hopefully learn how to kind of use it a little better. Hello, beautiful. Another tag. These stamps, these um, stickers were so, I got these from Tuesday morning, I loved them. They were just really nice, kind of thick stamp, uh, stickers. I keep calling them stamps. More lace. There's your beautiful paper, Sue. Scary. Another pocket. Some more ephemera in there. And that card, I love it. And here is a envelope that came with the kit. So cute. Love it. Very vintage looking. Love the way they um, add the flowers and, you know, just you don't have to be so scary. I like the, you know, different looks. That's why I like these kits, because they're kind of vintage. And I did tea dye all my papers. They feel really, really crinkly and old. There's Mr. Al. It's wicked. These are from, la that's from last year. This right here, it's trick or treat. A witch there. A little postcard. This owl, that owl on there is so cute. And that witch. Something to howl about. A cat. And then I put that on there as it's kind of the poison. And so I just put that on there. I thought it kind of went with the theme. But anyway, like I said, um, this little pocket here. These will be for sale in my Etsy store. So um, check it out, y'all. And thank y'all so much for watching. And I appreciate all your lovely comments and for subscribing to my channel. So be checking back with me. All right, y'all have a blessed day.